Hello, Assalamu alaikum. Hope everyone is doing well. Welcome to my channel. Uh, if you have subscribed me, thank you very much indeed. And if you haven't subscribed me yet, please consider to subscribe my channel. Uh, today, uh, blog is uh, traveling to London Heathrow. Uh, in this video, you'll see the motorway as well as uh, uh, London's Heathrow traffics. And beginning of this video, I'm gonna say thank you to my brother-in-law. He's a very kind man. He actually drive more than two and a half hours for me and um, drop us in Heathrow. Uh, such a fantastic man. He actually drove his Mercedes all the way two and a half hours, free of cost. Such benefits to have a, uh, a lovely family. Uh, let's talk about uh, the motorway and Cunnington's Road. So as you know, uh, London has uh, like uh, three lanes motorway and two, uh, two dual carriageway, two lanes uh, dual carriageways. So three lanes motorways also have uh, uh, one hard shoulder as well. And uh, also there is like three lanes with the hard shoulder, which is four lanes each side. But still there is some places is speed limit is 50 because of uh, uh, traffic flows and all these things. And you can see in the video how lovely the motorway is. It's such a beautiful motorway. And uh, many places is speed limit is 50 because of uh, traffic flow and things. And some places is obviously motorway speed limit is 70 and dual carriageway the maximum speed limit is 70. And for trailers, uh, 60. So anyway, uh, it was lovely long drive. And this area is a uh, motorway Hifro. So you can see the traffic flow and things like that. So if every country has a uh, motorway like this, but they have to have the law and order in place because uh, Motorway, you'll see every miles, every couple of miles, a few miles, you'll see, and the speed checker is there, so they will check average speed limits, average speed speed of the vehicles. That's why you cannot really exceed more than uh, seventy pounds or seventy miles. And if you, thanks for watching all the way. See you in next vlog. Bye now.